I'm very curious if a hundred years from now, if you go to the grave of a CNN anchor who passed of old age, and you look at the tombstone, is it going to be fake news written there? Because honestly, at this point, I would not be surprised. So yesterday, three people got fired. Tucker Carlson, as you guys know. Yuri from Face Connect. And uh, one more less significant firing, uh, Don Lemon. Now, the thing with Don Lemon is that uh, after getting fired, he said that uh, he was informed this morning by his agent that I have been terminated by the Clown News Network. I am stunned. After 17 years at the Clown News Network, I would have thought that someone in management would have had the decency to tell me directly. At no time was I ever given an indication that I would not be able to continue to do the work I have loved doing at the network. It is clear that there are some larger issues at play. With that said, I want to thank my colleagues and to the many teams I have worked with for an incredible run. They are most talented journalists in the business, and I wish them all the best. Now, due to the fact that the fact-checking at Twitter is now operated by the plebs, as in by the average citizen, we are added with a fact-checking, right? Readers added context. They thought people might want to know. Per the Cloud News Network PR, the statement is inaccurate. He was offered an opportunity to meet with management, but instead released a statement on Twitter. Even when fired, Dalemon cannot help himself. Like, he will spew fake news from beyond the grave. I, I mark my words. It, it's going to happen. Like, you know, someone is going to find a notebook. Someone is going to find, like, like some hieroglyphs, some, some ancient text, which he left in a time capsule. And when they open it, they're going to find fake news. I do not understand, like, why did he think this is a good idea? L like, you are now not part of the Cloud News Network. You are fighting against a media organization with a megaphone. And you think that lying about them is not going to end up with them exposing the truth? Especially when it's something like this, you know? Like, th this was hilarious. When I saw it, I, I thought, like, no, there is no fucking way. Because, <laughs> like, initially, I, I genuinely believed him. I was like, well, surely he's not going to lie about something that's easily fact-checkable. Oh, th there we go. You know, look, if you're part of Cloud News Network and you lie on their behalf, you don't get fact-checked. But when you lie against them and you're not part of them, well, then the fact-checkers kick in. So now Dolomar is treated like uh, any other pleb on the internet. You know, he, he's going to get fact-checked, both by the left and the right. Um, it is interesting though, right? So Dalaman is a very influential person and uh, I'm sure that he's going to find a job in another place. Uh, the Young Turks, for example, would be a very suitable environment for him. Like I, I can see Anna being pushed over to the Daily Wire. Can we imagine that, right? Like Anna Kasperian goes to the Daily Wire. She already had a um, segment over there. And uh, instead you get Dalaman to agree with Cenk Uger. Because I think, like, uh, he doesn't have a problem with the same issues that Anna Kasperian is raising. Like, for example, being called a uh, birthing person, uh, people with uteruses. I, I don't think Dalibar has an issue with that, right? And when it comes to race relations, uh, he is not controversial whatsoever. Like, he, he is very mainstream. At least the Dalaman of 2023, because I, I heard, uh, you know, the Dalaman uh, of two, 2015 or 2014. Talking about the fatherlessness problem in the black community. Like, that is controversial. That is controversial. But the modern uh, the Dalaman is not. So uh, I, I do think that he may have a good job at the Young Turks. Uh, I don't think he has a good job at Face Connect though. Right? I, I don't think like uh, if he tries to replace Yuri from Face Connect. I don't think that's going to work. But um, it would be funny though. If Tucker Carlson goes to CNN. I think like Tucker Carlson used to work at CNN. Am I wrong? I may be wrong, I need to check it out. I need to double check, like my chat told me. But it would be funny if Dalaman goes to Fox News and Tucker Carlson goes to CNN. I, I would pay to see that. Like, that would be hilarious, you know? Because like then people would, would wonder, like, what, what do we do with this information? Like, if you just have, like, Tucker on CNN, then people from CNN will leave. If you just have Don on, on Fox News, people will But, like, if they see the switcheroo, like, what would they do? Let me know what you guys think, and as usual, I will see you in the comment section. Take care.